beautiful friends. So today I have the glam bag for July 2013. It is July, right? So I miss June, and if you want to hear the whole story about that, just go watch my update video. So I do not have one for last month, and I apologize. Hopefully you guys found what you needed from other videos. But I am back with this month, so if you are interested in what was included in this month's bag, then just keep on watching. First of all, we have our informational card, as always, and our theme is Beach Beauty. So starting off with the bag itself, you can see it is hot pink and it is a clearish material. You can see everything in it. I think this is perfect if you were to use this to the beach just because you can see everything from the get-go. So once you pick up the bag, you can look to see if what you're looking for is in there. And I thought that was really, really cool. The shape is also different. It is like a cylinder. I actually really, really like that. And it just has their logo in the front right here. It just says Ipsy Beauty by You. First thing they picked out for us is a moisturizer, and this is a facial moisturizer. It has SPF in it, and it is by Kula. I think this is perfect for the summer because we do need protection on our faces. So it is SPF 20, and I put it on my face. It went on so smoothly, and I really like that it had a light feel to it. It didn't feel really heavy like a lot of other sunblocks do. It is unscented. And if you go on their website, you can buy the full version, which is 1.7 ounces for $36. The next thing we got is this little eyeshadow sample. And this is by BH Cosmetics, and I absolutely love this brand. And these colors are part of their California collection. So as you can see, there are the three different versions that they have for the California collection. So we have Hollywood, which is a deep plumish purple color, and it is sort of on the matte side. Then we have San Francisco, which is really, really bronzy and sparkly. And this goldish, yellowish color, which they named Malibu. Swatches! I really like that these colors are super pigmented. I pack them on my eyelids and they just go on so flawlessly. I really, really love it and they are also easy to blend. And if you actually go on their website, you cannot purchase all three of them together or even single ones that I found, but I did find individual palettes. They are eyeshadow palettes with blushes and they are kind of worked around each color. So they have three different versions. So they have the Hollywood palette, San Francisco palette, and the Malibu palette. And I actually have Malibu on right now. It is a pretty gold color and I absolutely love it. So each palette is actually really expensive. It's about $17, but as of right now, today is July 15th. They are on sale for about $10. So hopefully by the time you guys see this, that sale is still going on for you. Next thing is by Pop Beauty. And all it is, it is a lip crown, and the color that I got is Coral Crush. And you cannot buy these individually on their websites. It does come in a kit for about $25, and I believe it has like six or seven different colors, this one included. I really, really like that it is a retractable crown, so you don't have to worry about wasting it or wasting your time sharpening or anything like that. The color goes on really sheer, but it is buildable. I have it on my lips right now. It is about three layers of this color. And I love that it doesn't have a really weird smell to it. A lot of lip products smell really weird. This one has a pleasant smell. And a tint, and this is by Benefit. And you can actually use this as a blush for rosy cheeks, or you can use it on your lips, and I believe it will kind of look like a lip stain. But this is what the bottle looks like. As you can see, it is just like a very dark red liquid, and I have seen That's Heart use this in some of her tutorials, and it does look flawless. The last thing we got is by Big and Sexy Hair. This is another sample size. And this is their humidity resistant spray. And it says that it's weatherproof. So I'm going to shake it. I'm going to see what it's about. It smells really, really good. I like that it didn't spray out white because a lot of sprays have a white color and that doesn't go good with my roots. Uh, and yeah, I think I really, really like it. It smells really good, so I'm not sure exactly what it does, if it prevents frizziness or anything like that. But I do like the smell and it did give a little bit of shine, so I'm good with that. 
that is all that was included in this month's bag. Hopefully these videos are helpful. I try to be as helpful as possible. I know these videos are always so short and I don't want it to be kind of a just showing you what it is and leave it at that. I do want to try out the products for you guys and let you know how I think about it. So hopefully you guys like that and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for stopping by, saying hello and showing your support and I will see you guys later. Bye!